bunnies and welcome back or to Woodland Bunny a cozy space to talk books. So today we are going to go through all of my own TBR which of course as you can tell by the project name I am intending to get my TBR down to zero so all of the books which I own that I haven't yet read down to zero. So we're going to be doing an end of year check-in to see how I've progressed with this goal. I kind of somewhat knew I would never get down to zero to the end of this year but the whole point was just to motivate me to get this project going and I'm going to be carrying it on into 2024. I just have such an urge to read all of the books I own because this project has made me so excited to shop my bookshelves and just revitalize my uh, love for the books that I picked up and the reasons why I picked them up to begin with rather than them being just sat on my shelves or adventured into. So without further ado and too much more rambling I'm going to count all of the books on my shelves that I haven't yet read. I'll give you the numbers as we go but but as caveat, I'm not going to include all of the books I'm currently making my way through to all of the books in which I'm currently reading. And then I'm also not going to include my classics. I know that they are books, but I just have a different time trajectory for getting to those. And I have a whole separate project on which I want to do with my classics. So because I've done so much more rambling, let's get to actually counting all of the books on my TBR. So let's go. I just finished counting all of my books and at the beginning of 2023 I had 134 books on my TBR and ending 2023 I have a total of 81 books on my TBR in which I'm pretty proud about that's around 50 books read um I have been obviously adding to my TBR throughout the year I remember in February I went to London and I had a huge book haul from that alongside that I also had my birthday in August which I hauled some books then too so I feel like I have done quite quite well to have read 50 and to be at 81 despite having hauled some books in between um, and I'm happy with the progress that I'm making. Fingers crossed I can continue to get it down throughout the year of 2024. If you haven't watched my end of year tag I did mention in that that I didn't want to put as much restriction as I have this year. I feel like I've put a lot of pressure on myself as to reading the books I own and which of course is so important because why would you buy the books if you're not going to read them but sometimes I have stopped myself from enjoying a new release or just buying a book which I found really interesting because I knew I had books at home and I don't want reading to become like a guilty thing or something that I must or mustn't do. It's something which I truly love, truly enjoy and why would I miss out on an opportunity to read a different book because I know these books will be here no matter what. So thank you ever so much for watching friends. I hope you enjoyed coming on this adventure with me. It was so interesting to see what I have read throughout the year and if you have been here since the beginning of the year, thank you so much for your support it genuinely and truly means the world so i hope that wherever you are and whatever you're doing you have a wonderful day or night and until next time bye